This is a productive day in my life at UC Berkeley. It's seven o'clock in the morning right now and I got a pretty packed day ahead of me. But you know what the first thing in the morning is, of course. How are you doing? Alright. We're off to the gym. The gym. I start up most days with going to the gym. I love the morning atmosphere here, and it's a great way to get the ball rolling. It like focuses my mind, and then I'm like, no matter what I've done through the rest of the day, I've done the gym. Success. <laughs> Success. What are your plans? I'm going to go back, take a shower, and then head to the first class of the day. First class of the day. 203, social issues of technology. It's not too bad. Building. Beautiful Bay Area weather. We're almost not late. We're what almost not late. late. First class. This class is about how technology affects society and on the other hand, how humans shape the technology and how we use it. It's probably one of the most interesting classes I've taken here. So I feel like that's the example where it could be. It's going. That's good. I'm oh. filming today. After class, we did some filming for the school social media page. And of course, we're trying to bring that down this, in the history of What's your number one advice to stay productive? You can't operate on empty. You need like mm. rest, you need like food, you need energy. Take rest when you need it. So the first class is done. We are gonna go ahead to the cafe to get some work done and then head to the dining hall for lunch. Please, please, please. Sitting together with people really helps me stay focused. I'm just less likely to scroll on social media when others are around. <laughs> this is how you stay productive, black coffee. I like just like brain dumping onto a, a good post and write everything down, every single thing that's in my in my brain. The minute something's assigned, just do ten minutes on it. And if I feel some momentum and I keep going, like, that's great. Um, but it's like I haven't like completely waited to the last minute. We then spent the last fifteen minutes looking for housing options for the next semester. What? Yeah, yeah, yeah. About the Whoa. swing set. Oh, that's crazy. We could okay. be oh, that's swinging. <laughs> Can't see you falling asleep in class. It's no, a productive no, day. No. So uh, taking naps is productive? Yes, power naps. Very productive. <laughs> Let's get some good, good lunch. We're gonna get some good, some good chicken. I skip breakfast most days, so I'm pretty hungry around noon. I love eating with other people, and honestly, it's nice to not look at a screen for a while. Office hours. I go to office hours weekly and bottom with my professor. It helps me understand the course material and it can give me a job down the line. Don't procrastinate, get your work yeah. done. The biggest thing I think is forcing myself to get things done early. I do a lot of Google Calendar time blocking. Mondays, I make a schedule of everything I need to do for the week. And then I just try and follow that and like make time for my personal things such as like going to the gym. You have to look at the bigger picture. Not just for yourself, but also like our families have sent us to reality and say you're not always going to be productive. And coming to terms with that is important as well. I'm so sorry, I'm on a Zoom right oh, now. Oh, you know Zoom? I'm, I'm sorry. Yeah, you look locked in. <laughs> I'm sorry. All right, so I am off to the second class of the day, which is user experience research. And we actually have a midterm presentation today, so wish me luck. We met up briefly before class to rehearse. Our presentation is about a project that we're doing with the client who wants to explore AI user interface patterns. Popcorn to class. Damn. Here, take a bite. I can't go without snacks. Snacks are essential. We first listened to some other groups presenting, and then it was our turn. They might be the ones making the purchasing decision because they want to use these. <laughs> oh my god. Just finished the presentation. It was good. This is the post presentation brief. Um, I think we did. <laughs> Mexican beer is just a few shades away from water. So, like... <laughs> I think a big part of productivity is yeah. being kind to yourself, to be human. And that means being imperfect. <laughs> wow. All of that is to say. 
Try hard, but forgive yourself. So I just finished the second class of the day and I'm about to head to San Francisco for a career event at the Salesforce Tower. There are so many different career and networking events that the school offers and they're a great way to get to know people. It's also cool to explore the city. There's a cute cafe at the top with probably one of the most scenic co-working spaces I've ever seen. We have models that can predict this stuff and actually they're very good at it. Say something to the microphone. I'm not. Great <laughs> event. It was amazing, right? Yeah, I can see myself up here in Salesforce. And we got free coffee. Yeah, we, we got a lot of free coffee. Yeah, free coffee. After the event, I took an Uber back to Berkeley to visit some friends for dinner. We are gonna go get some Korean barbecue. What's the plan? Sensei. All the, all the white boys can chill there. What? <laughs> I usually get food from the dining hall, but it's nice to get together and cook every now and then. Their house also had an amazing rooftop access. It just opens up like that. This was my first time trying traditional Korean barbecue. I'm not usually a fan of pork, but I gotta say it was pretty solid. Put the kimchi, add the two fundamental pork cut belly and shoulder. And what is the, the sushi looking thing? Oh, this is... <laughs> <laughs> oh, is it? Have so a yeah. yeah. Bye! Alright, so I'm heading to a friend's place because we have a client meeting right now. Our course project is with the client in India, and that means our meetings are usually quite late for Pacific time. So we want to overwhelm the users while they're doing it. And then we spoke a little bit about research methods that we can apply so far. Schedule yeah. that we discussed at first instead of All uh, the notes. notes. All of the notes. What a great notes. team member. <laughs> face mask? Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it. <laughs> Look at this face mask heaven. <laughs> Step number seven is take them off and get rid, period. <laughs> Get rid of <laughs> Get rid. <laughs> I feel whole. <laughs> You're winning the award for the most beautiful room. I do have pride in this room. Like it helps peace of mind, it helps declutter not only your space but your, your mind. I have other cares in my life, but my space is always nice. Mm -hmm. And that helps me tackle the other shit I need to do. Feelings, so deep in the feelings. We are off to the library for a late night study session. I listen to the Oppenheimer soundtrack a lot. It gets you in the zone and then you feel like you're in a movie so then you're more productive. Mm -hmm. There's just something magical about the late night atmosphere here. The silence, the lights, and just seeing how focused everyone is. I think it's a beautiful way to end the day. Just got kicked out of the library. We're, we're too productive. <laughs>